Our low angle paddle offerings at Warner feature a long slender blade shape, which is great for low angle style of paddling. And that's keeping your wrists below your shoulders, going out for a nice cruise on the water. We find that about 70 to 80% of our paddlers uh, that come to purchase a Warner paddle favor this low angle style of blade. A few components that you're gonna find on every Warner paddle is our Smart View ferrule system. With the push of a button, this paddle comes open and apart for easier travel. And it also allows you to adjust your feather angle either for left-handed paddling or right-handed paddling by lining up this line to this dot and simply clicking it together. It provides a nice one-piece feel as well as a low-profile button. Best option for performance on the market. Provides a nice option for travel and adjustability. So the paddle in my hands right now is the Callista. This is all our ultimate performance paddle, our nicest, lightest paddle in our lineup. It features a, a carbon makeup, and what we know about carbon is it's light, but it's also stiff. You'll see that the blade is nice and rigid, which provides maximum power transfer in the water. You'll also find this ridge down the center of the paddle. This ridge is what we call dihedral, and it allows the water to hit the center of the blade and shed off evenly, creating a nice stable stroke as you pull the paddle through the water. You'll also see that the blade profile is thicker. And what that thicker blade profile does is it provides buoyancy to give the paddle lift and release at the end of the stroke. Lightweight, Carbon shaft, carbon blade, the Callista is an excellent option for those looking to maximize performance on the water. So the next paddle in our lineup we're going to talk about is our premium fiberglass Kameno. It's got a nice vibrant color option to it in either a citrus or a blue abyss. This paddle has been on the market for many years and it's the go-to uh, for many touring or recreational paddlers. It features a high impact fiberglass layup. So for those of you who are pushing off the bottom of uh, the, the ocean or out in the lake, it's very impact resistant. We double the material up here at the tip. You'll see that it comes standard with a, a SmartView ferrule system as well. Standard on the Kameno, provides a nice easy way for paddlers to adjust their offset either for left-handed or for right-handed paddlers. Simply line up the desired offset line that you want with the window, pop it together for a nice low profile one piece feel. So the Kameno blade features a high impact resistant fiberglass material. You'll see that at the tip, we double the material up or layer it up heavier because that's the portion of the paddle that's going to take more abuse. The bright, vibrant, high definition color pairs well with many boats on the market today and it's also very visible when out in open water. Okay, moving into our standard line of touring paddles, we offer the Skagit uh, named after the Skagit River here, close to our factory. The Skagit features a nylon injection molded blade, nice and durable, our dihedral ridge down the center. The one thing you're gonna lose with nylon is the stiffness and the weight's gonna come up considerably. So while we suggest either the Callista or the Kameno for the best experience on the water, the Skagit's not a bad option for somebody who's going to paddle maybe a, a, you know, three to four times a month through the summer. But again, for the best paddling experience, we would suggest paddlers choose the Callista or the Kameno.